Shalom and it's a pleasure to come back again to join with you to learn and to meditate on God's word afresh for this day. We've been looking into the wisdom of God and today we focus on wisdom that is marked by meekness. Reading from James chapter 3 verses 13 to 15, who is wise and understanding among you? Let him show by good conduct that his works are done in the meekness of wisdom. But if you have bitter envy and self-seeking in your hearts, do not boast and lie against the truth. This wisdom does not descend from above, but is earthly, sensual and demonic. Today's scripture shows us that those who live by the wisdom of God live in gentleness and meekness the wisdom of god is meek and gentle and those who live by it live a life of gentleness and meekness so what is meekness meekness according to the bible is being humble and gentle towards others and also willing to be submissive to the lord submissive and completely wholly obedient to the lord so how does a meek person treat others a meek person treats others not just in their words but also in their actions so how does meekness make one wise it is in the way that the truth of god's word is applied in our lives it is also we show meekness when we are in constant um humility and being tuned to the spirit of god we do not work on our own understanding or on our own knowledge but we depend completely on the spirit of god for giving us our decisions that shows meekness now meekness in wisdom causes a person to consider his actions and words before he acts hastily so there is a point that we think about what would the spirit want us to do and how do we act on it now meekness and wisdom should be in tandem we may see people who are gentle and meek but don't but are not wise or, or do not give good wisdom they may be like gentle pushovers or they may be those who may be wise but have no gentleness and meekness that shows a sense of pride and arrogance meekness lends dignity to wisdom and that's what makes it easier for others to listen to them when we look at the old testament there was one person who was known to be meek who was known to be very meek more than all the people who were on the face of the earth god described moses as meek even though he had the wisdom of god he lived his life with meekness and humility always depending on the wisdom and the understanding the direction and the knowledge of god so even as we make our choices today may we remember to live a life of meekness and gentleness may our actions and our words be meek as we live in wisdom let's pray together heavenly father we see from your word that you want us to live a life marked in meekness and may our wisdom be especially marked in wisdom may our, may we be gentle and meek in the way that we deal with others the way that we um help others make decisions thank you for your word that has encouraged our hearts that has shown us a way to live in jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org